pretty savage, and it is. And her opponent, weighing at 110 pounds and hailing from Ronkonkoma, New York, ladies and gentlemen, Brittany Savage. Definitely a hometown reaction here on Long Island for the Ronkonkoma native, Brittany Savage. You just see the smiling, she's, she's almost bubbling, is Brittany Savage. Hard to imagine, just a few months ago. Brittany giving up some size and experience to social in this one. Clean break out of the corner. No cheap shots by either participant in this one. Brittany certainly, definitely, at least trying to breathe new life into her career here in WSU. She won the J Cup earlier this year. She defeated Sassy Stephanie in the finals in that one. Of course, took Mercedes Martinez to the limit at the Uncensored Rumble. And for a couple of minutes, at least, it looked like she was the new WSU world champion. Newfound respect since then from Brittany to Mercedes. Of course, she came to Mercedes and Alicia's rescue, set up the big War Games match November 19 on internet pay-per-view, gofightlive.com for more details on that one. Nice hip toss there from Brittany, going for a quick one in. Not enough. This should be a good one because Andy can't really afford to lose, looking to try to reestablish herself here in WSU. That roll-up wasn't enough right by the ropes there. And Brittany, of course, keeping up the momentum going in to the November 19 War Games. So a lot on the line here at this PWS event. Big time, 360 forearm. Picked up that steam and just laid out Brittany Savage with that move. What a what a big time move that was from Annie Social. That was the, the size being displayed from Social, trying to use more of it. And Brittany was able to duck out of the way. Now she's got Social in the corner, driving herself into Annie Social. A Bronco Buster from Brittany Savage. Haven't seen that in quite some time here in WSU. This is just a new packaging of Brittany Savage. And she seems to be having a great time, as do these fans here. And they're getting exactly what they wanted. They wanted another Bronco Buster. Savage is there to give, give it to them. Going back to that super kick, I think she wanted to give Savage earlier. Ducks underneath, diamond cutter, nope. Social saw that coming. She's about to get slammed into the ground and use that split. We saw her do earlier to kind of stop the momentum and like a hawk, like a real veteran, Brittany knew where she was and was able to clasp this rear naked choke onto any Social. The referee's got a good view of it to see that it's not exactly a choke. And I don't know if you could tell by your vantage point, but. Brittany's got her right leg over, over Annie's right leg, and she's really got all the leverage here, and Annie's arm is down for a third time. You get the official word. The winner of the bout, Ron Kalkama's own, Brittany Savage. What a veteran move from Brittany Savage. She saw an opening on Annie Social, and she just cinched in that rear naked choke, hung on for it, saw that, hey, I can pick up a W here, and she did just that. Big win for Brittany Savage over Annie Social in front of her hometown crowd. Nice show of sportsmanship there. Big win for Brittany Savage. <laughs>